Hey y'all, my name is Janine and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be explaining what a declaration page is. And that's just a big old fancy word for the first page of your policy. So listen, that page is where you will find how much your house is covered for just in case you have damages. You're also going to find your name, address, whoever else's name is on the policy with yours, whether it's your husband's or your wife, mama, auntie, and your mortgage company. The mortgage company name is on the declaration page of your insurance because they have a financial interest in your home. Now, when you bought the home, the mortgage company said, okay, I'm going to loan you this money, but my name is going on that house so that if anything happens to it, I can get my money back. So that's the reason you take out insurance for your home. So now you have a financial interest in your home and your husband, auntie, mama, whomever else you have listed there and the mortgage company. Now let me give you a story. The other day an insurer called in and she was a little upset because she couldn't cash the check because the mortgage company's name was on it. So I said to her, well, I'm sorry. Unfortunately, I can't remove the mortgage company from your check because they have a financial interest in your home. Well, she was 38 hot with me. And she asked for my manager. So I said, okay, you can speak to my manager. So I <coughs> sent her right on over to the manager. Manager told the same thing I told her. You see, she got these monies and she didn't want to go through the trouble of calling up her mortgage company, asking these people, hey, I have this check. Where can I send it? Y'all need to sign it and send it back. She didn't want to do that. She wanted to take that $75,000, stick it in her account, and I don't know, do whatever. But anyway, you can't do anything with claims monies unless the mortgage company's name is on it. That's for the mortgage company to secure their assets. Because if something happens to you and their name's not on that property, then they're out of $100,000, dollars $300,000. They can just give away money up there. That's not going to happen. So keep in mind, if you put in a claim and you get a large amount of money back to fix your property, that mortgage company is going to have their name on that check. You're going to have to send it to them to get it signed. They'll send it back. You sign it, deposit it into your account, repair your property. Other than that, you're going to be whistling in the wind because it's not going to happen. We're not taking it off. We're just not going to do that. Now. If you find this information helpful, go ahead and subscribe, ring the bell, go ahead and share it out because you know you're going to want more and I'll talk to you next time.